Hello everyone, let's go over Shiba Inu's chart and see where it's currently at. But first, let's take a look at the entire global crypto market. The market cap is a little over 2.3 trillion, so it's pretty flat over yesterday. It's not really doing much. Bitcoin, Ethereum are all pretty flat. Same goes for Shiba Inu. Let's take a look at Shiba Inu's market cap, which is currently a little over 10 billion. So it has a long way to go to reach one of the top five cryptocurrencies, which range anywhere from 68 billion to Bitcoin, which is slightly over a trillion dollars. So there is an enormous amount of potential for Shiba Inu going forward. Keep in mind that this is a new cryptocurrency. It was introduced in August of 2020. For it to be already a top 20 cryptocurrency says a lot about its popularity and strength. Let's take a look at an hourly chart of Shiba and see where it's currently at. Please remember I'm not a financial advisor. This is only for entertainment purposes and these are only my opinions. Here's an hourly chart of Shiba and as you can see the recent high it made was 0.000358 on October 7th. Since then it's been going down but finding support along the way which is a great sign. So it doesn't feel like a pump and dump this time. It found support at the 2059 level on October 7, which was key and different from some of the other rallies for Shiba where the price would not hold support and would just drop through key levels. Since it found support at 2059, it has rebounded slightly, riding along the 9 EMA briefly, which is a good sign, and being above the VWAP and the 50 EMA. It cracked below the 9 EMA here and it looks like it's about to reclaim it. However, it's still below VWAP for the time being, which is the blue line on the chart. The price wants to consolidate between these two horizontal lines between 2555 and 2893. If it breaks above 2893, the next major resistance level is 3558 level. So in my opinion, I think there's a good chance that it tests that price level next week. We need to see higher volume if we're going to test that area and break through it. That's all I have for today. Be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.